Hi, welcome back to my channel. Um, I thought I'd do a quick video on what my thoughts are on whether higher education is worth it for certain purposes. Obviously, I always speak about this from my standpoint rather than like um, someone else's standpoint. These are obviously like my views, um, and, like what I thought was helpful about it, and like just what maybe I change or looking back wouldn't change because at the end of the day you can't change anything with stuff like that um it's what it is um but luckily they've been doing it for a fair few years so they kind of can do what they think is right so basically i had two parts of my higher education where i honestly when i left school really wanted to go and work in little um i had a set of the, the wages looked high they were about nine pound forty an hour and the wages were high um and yeah like I just like wanted to go work in Idle but um was convinced into doing a course at college at, at, at um my sit well, the local sit form um which I went to I spoke about in other videos didn't did come to have my mental health decline um in the first year and I didn't like the course, so I went back the next year. We're not talking about mental health in this video, um, but I still obviously like did my schooling and everything like that. I didn't like obviously that was a separate part of my life. I still went through school, um, and yeah, like um, I just feel like it, it is a good system for learning skills like perseverance in life because I, it's got to be said like in mainstream school. It's just a bit different because you have to be there. Everyone has to be there. So even people that wouldn't go to sit form are there because they have to be, or like some people like that don't want to don't want to go to sit form are there. And I never thought I'd do A levels to be honest. Never thought I would. I mean, I just I don't really think about it. Um, I thought I'd, I just wasn't really key on the idea. Went back, as I said, the, the year after I left, and went and did RS Media and Art, and um basically just like didn't actually love the subjects but literally thinking about it now they're very apt for what I'm doing on this channel which obviously the creative side of of everything photography editing stuff like that media is quite related art is quite related to just the way I edit it and I'm creative about it and then RS like I talk a lot about religion because I went to a Catholic school in previous years. This wasn't a Catholic sit form. But thinking about it, I really wanted to do psychology, sociology and biology. But really, it turned out absolutely fine, really, that what I was studying. So even though I actually found them quite quite boring, if I'm honest, um, the way it was all taught and everything, I, it was it was good. But and to be fair, the, the days are split up in higher education where usually you've got... And most people will know this, uh, but if you don't know, they're usually split into three hour stints or four hour stints um it's rare that you have a whole day like a full school day in in college or a sit form so obviously i'll speak for my sit form experience first because i did go to college as well and i might get compared the two as well actually um so because um i wasn't too keen i think the school i went to it was it was it was connected to other schools so one of them was like a grammar school and one of them was like um a comprehensive and um but they were all like interlinked um when you'd go on buses between each one um so yeah i mean it wasn't riveting i'm not gonna lie um <laughs> i don't really know what i was gonna expect like it wasn't turning i didn't turn up and expect to be riveted to be honest i was just happy to be there like i suppose anyone would be because truthfully they do like it was quite a um communal school that i went to like they were it was quite a community based ethos um and stuff it was quite nice to have been involved in that to be honest um and yeah like i obviously again like this is separate i mean it's not even worth saying really actually i won't say that but basically yeah i'm just trying to think um so art i've mentioned in my last video was good but i found that it was quite like tedious when you had to like do the long hours and you could you didn't have a creative flow like actual subjects aside because they're not really that relevant i'm talking about what you actually learn from the um 
thing. I should have really made some notes, this would have been a lot easier. So just you kind of like, you learn perseverance mainly, I think that is the biggest thing. Um, and also just like different skills and like just having to adapt to different ways of like learning. Um, with like sometimes you have coursework and sometimes you have like exams and stuff um, and you might not be used to coursework if you haven't done that in GCSE um, and just basically just I guess meeting new people and all that stuff so after all that I went to college um, and it was just I feel like the atmosphere was a little bit different because um, it's not obviously connected to like a main school so it's just I mean it's, it's kind of similar but it's kind of they treat you more like adults there I think this is just like a commonality that people use like they do treat you more adult there in um college possibly I don't know I did do an adult course so that could have had something to do with it to be fair um but again it was just perseverance and like I think it's just good at helping build that there's an there's an end goal kind of mindset um which is healthy but it's also I'm starting to adapt past that way of thinking because I think sometimes when you have there's an end goal mindset it's hard to sometimes find gratification um you're finding instant gratification but you're not finding gratitude um in the present always and you're sometimes just like waiting for the end goal but I suppose I don't know how helpful this video was but I thought I'd just do a quick video on it okay.